righty, things are starting to heat up at Canada's Wonderland. Well, hopefully, literally, on that note, warm weather would be welcomed. But nonetheless, work on Mindbuster continues. Moosehorn Falls um, is having some of its footings dug out. So as you can see there, they got some of the, the locations for the footings. Um, so that's really exciting. Again, they are moving a lot quicker than they normally would for obvious reasons, 2025. So the company that has to do Moosehorn Falls and Front Gate is obviously in charge of the 2025 coaster. So, for example, Wonderland typically wouldn't start water slide construction until very late winter, early spring. Um, but we're seeing all of that work take place in very early winter. So I think that they're aiming to be done, you know, in the next month. That doesn't mean water slide going up. That's an easy project in itself, but that means like the footing and the, um, what do you call it, infrastructure for the water slide complete. Over at Front Gate, they are clearing out the other side, the left side of the building. So they are removing all of Wonderland's stuff. Um, so I don't know what that entails. Obviously, you can't see from this far away, but it looks like paperwork and all that. Um Hartwell is in that building as well, so obviously working on electrical. I keep forgetting these company names. There's so many companies working at Wonderland. I have to like access my database in my head and figure it out. This is the ice rink removal. So this is the company just removing, I think it's the rental company, uh, removing that uh, giant freezer that freezes uh, Snowflake Lake. Um, so that's all that is. Over at Front Gate, um, lots going on. The logo isn't down. Again, that is a telltale sign, so I'll be keeping an eye on that. But nothing too exciting. Again, you can see them digging out the electrical heading towards front gate. Um, so there you have a, a giant line coming from um, what I'll explain in the podcast is going on over there, but not yet, um, heading towards the front gate building. So that's going to be a key factor for this new area. Um, it definitely is going to entail our new app, just as a little teaser. Um, but yeah, so I'm I'm really excited for this new front gate, even if it ends up being a soft reno, which I'm really hoping not. Why spend the money if you're not going to do it all? I really, I, this is we're going to start upsetting some roller coaster enthusiasts. They need to remove the Leviathan colors from front gate. The Leviathan colors on our front gate building are so tacky. Like it looks like an old government building in my opinion. And here is some exciting news. So on top of Wonder Mountain, I was about to say on top of Wonder Mountain's Guardian. In the only section that a coaster could really come out of without impacting too much. And that's saying a lot because Thunder Run, Vortex, and Guardian are all kind of like right there. There's only two spots that this coaster can come out of. Right where you see those construction workers right now. Or just off to the right of the turn after the uh, lift hill of um, Vortex. So those are the two locations. But these workers do walk over there. Um, so these are two, from what I understand, construction workers. But again, extremely difficult to tell from all the way over here. Um, but nonetheless, uh, work is continuing inside the mountain, I have heard through the birdies. Um, so just because we can't see cars parked outside the mountain anymore does not mean work isn't continuing inside the mountain. Furthermore, I've been instructed that um, those forms we saw uh, were in the mountain for a reason. So again, we may not be able to see much from the outside. And remember, I fly the drone for about 40 minutes a day. There's a lot of unaccounted time um, that maybe doesn't see a cement truck go in the mountain or doesn't see um, a specific vehicle go in the mountain. So there's a lot that we are not seeing um, on paper so I'll fill in the blanks um, through other resources. But nonetheless, um, those forms in the mountain were there for a reason, early Halloween haunt. Um, so work is definitely continuing inside the mountain. There are multiple projects they are working on inside the mountain as well. So Thunder Run being one of them and um, this new coaster being another. And obviously they still have the bin system for Wonder Mountain's Guardian as well. But I've seen no signs of them working on that. Um, with that being said, that's all there is for today's construction update. Again, these construction updates are always a day behind now. So this was filmed yesterday, January 17th. Um, I fly every day, I update my Patreons, and then I upload these the next day. Um, if there's ever any breaking, breaking news, like that I'm like, okay, this needs to go out. Don't worry, it'll go out. Um, but Patreons know first. Um, but yeah, thanks so much. I'm really excited for the podcast tomorrow. Tune in tomorrow at 8 p.m. for the podcast. Really excited about that. Um, I've withheld a lot of information, including my seven-part series, because it didn't make sense to release that information and then discuss it again on the podcast. I wanted the podcast to have some juicy information. All right. Thanks so much, guys. Have a good one. Bye.